good morning today is july 16th it is 10 52 in the morning i'm about to take prints out and take down my hair i curled it yes well like two days ago but i didn't keep the curls or whatever so now i had put my little handy dandy little flexi rod situation thing i have a mount for my camera on the mirror but here go me not wanting to put it up and be difficult why do I look like orange? Mm, I don't like that. I need to get some more light bulbs for up here. I want them to be white and they're kind of like yellow. I guess that's why I'm looking like this. <clears throat> and it's kind of hard to see, so I want like bright white lights. And I have like a makeup stain right here, so disregard that. And I need to get me a new bra this week. That's probably what we're going to go do too when I get paid for my job job well i get paid from youtube and my job i get paid for everything this week like the amazon stuff like everything we're gonna get paid this week so this is how i preserve my curls or whatever in this little long flexi rod flexi rod situation thing anyways if you're new here hey my name is akira janae don't forget to subscribe and join the family before subscribe and join the family before you leave um Today, the only thing I have planned is to just literally edit until this one video is done that I'm supposed to post this Thursday. I'm turning in my laptop. I think I told y'all this in the last vlog or something, but my battery on my laptop is trash. So if it's not connected to the um, power, it's going to go off in like 15 minutes. So basically, they're going to replace my battery for like $150 plus tax is like $160 something. Um, I'm going to pick that up this Thursday or Friday. So, yeah. But I got to drop it off today because I may, I don't have to drop it off today. But I did make an appointment today. So, if I don't get done, I mean, I can just try to reschedule like the drop off for tomorrow. It should be no problem. But, yeah. That's kind of what we're doing. I don't want to comb these out too much. So, I'm just going to kind of finger comb. But that little flexi rod thing, chef's kiss. It literally just effortless heatless curls and i don't know why i haven't been doing that i should have did this for nikki's birthday so i didn't have to curl it and all my curls fell and i didn't get a good picture so now i gotta wear that dress over again but anywho i'm gonna make my little weekly to-do list that y'all saw me do in the last one i do work my actual like clock in job <laughs> i think i work thursday and friday or either friday and saturday i'm not sure but i only work two days this week obviously and i'm not picking up anything so i'm going to plan out my day for really today is just getting this video done edited and then i'll probably <clears throat> clean up so use the rest of my sunday as like a um sunday reset i guess if you will and then i will um start actually doing stuff doing stuff for monday tuesday and wednesday and i'm gonna need like some more layers or something because this is not doing it for me but yeah i'm about to take prints outside and i'll come back with y'all i really don't i don't have no breakfast food i don't got i don't got no groceries so i gotta go grocery shopping or do an online order like delivery so they can come deliver it to my um apartment i'll probably do that since it'll be for today and yeah, that's kind of all I got planned for today. Um, today is going to be boring, so I'll probably just pick up the camera here and there. I'm literally just going to be editing for the next. I'm going to set aside, since I am on a new software and trying to do new stuff. Um, and I am. I'm about to go ahead and cook, too. Um, I took down some chicken wings and stuff, whatever, last night. So I'm just going to start cooking it today um for like my lunch, I guess. Because it's going to take an hour for it to like really get done. So when I get back from taking prints out i'm gonna put on my lunch dinner or whatever but i'm gonna set aside probably i'm gonna do two hours to finish editing because i'm halfway through the vlog i'm just gonna rewatch the vlog and then add in some more stuff so the vlog was an hour and like two an hour and like 40 50 minutes so about two hours i got it down right now to like an hour and 37 but this is just me just doing like a rough cut. So I am trying to get it down to like an hour or like 50 minutes or something. Because this isn't like a... Well, this is my weekly vlog. Yeah, I vlogged the whole week. But anyways, this isn't like a work with me weekly weekly vlog. This is like a, I guess, balancing work and like vacation time. Anyways, y'all done already seen it by now. So 
yeah that's what i'm gonna do um i would like to have the video done edited because it's about i might as well say it's 11 o'clock i want me to be done editing by at least one and then i still have to save it and then upload it to youtube and the youtube uploads because i record in 4k whatever and the vlogs be long it usually take about like two hours to upload so like literally i'm going to be getting done <laughs> like it's going to be getting done like right by as long as i'm done by 5 40. So yeah, I'm gonna stop talking because I've been talking for about five minutes and I'm gonna get back with y'all when I come back in to cook my lunch slash dinner for today. And then I'll probably put in some clips like a little clean with me or whatever because that's really all I'm gonna be doing because I cannot work in mess. I have to have my house clean for me to just get it together, okay? Okay. <laughs> I just got home. My mom been on FaceTime with her probably for about almost an hour, so that slowed me down. It's 11.55. I'm just not about to start editing, so I said I wanted to be done by 1. Hmm. We're going to see if I can, like, fast edit, because I'm almost done, but then I got to... Anyways, I'm about to finish editing. Um, uh, Y'all saw me put... I don't know if voiceover Akira was telling y'all what I was doing or not, but basically it's supposed to be kind of what i cook what i call my famous meal um like the chicken and potatoes and creamy chicken in the um oven but this time i took a recipe from tiktok so basically all i was saying to kind of speed up this because i was talking for a long time in these clips i took a recipe from tiktok it's basically just cream of chicken your choice of chicken whether that be chicken wings legs breast that whatever and then you'll put in um like vegetables like the bell peppers and stuff i didn't have any bell peppers so i just put in potatoes in mine but next time i do cook this for me and bay i'm going to use the onions and the bell peppers and stuff like that and i also said i would put spinach in it but i didn't have any spinach um so i'm just going to be cooking this with rice and yeah that's basically it <laughs> update it is a 132 and i am 41 minutes into my vlog and right now the vlog is an hour and seven minutes i'm still cutting down <laughs> so yeah i've been i've been doing i've been getting distracted not even gonna lie but i'm 41 minutes in and i'm almost done editing then i'm gonna watch it fully through and then add the finishing touches and then save but um i never really cook rice for myself with this i always i literally use this rice maker probably one time for myself the rest i use it for prints from when he's sick um so yeah I just put some butter, salt, and pepper. Girl, I don't even know how to cook. Like, how do you season rice? I know a lot of people like sugar. I don't know if that's like a down south thing or whatever, but I don't think I would like no sugar in no rice. Which I like sugar and spaghetti, but I don't know. This is probably a weird combination for a lot of y'all because some of y'all was talking about me eating chicken and macaroni but this is literally the only food that i have left in my apartment so i gotta make do with what i got and it's sunday so i needed a good sunday type of dinner so yeah period and also i would eat macaroni with anything like i would eat macaroni with cereal <laughs> like <laughs> i will eat with anything so yes i eat it with chicken wings all of that so, Sunday meal, so hmm, yes, and I kind of want to drink some wine, but girl, 
I'll probably say that for tonight. I did bust open my wine that I got in Hot Springs. Uh, Y'all probably saw that in the last vlog. We went, went wine tasting. I drank some last night. So good. So I'm about to just drink some water because I literally have nothing else to drink. So my battery's about to die. So I'll talk to y'all when I get done editing. So the time is now 5.54. I just got back in with Prince. Um, I got done, like completely done with the video at like 5.30 give or take. So I did miss my appointment today. Um, they are about to close in like five minutes and my vlog is on CapCut actually saves pretty fast like I'm on 44.2 percent and this is a 58 minute video and this is 19 gigabytes in 4k so already I'm already loving CapCut like I feel like that's saving really really fast then I just gotta upload it so I'm gonna drop off my laptop probably tomorrow morning I'm gonna wake up and do that so I'm gonna go ahead and rip off of this one i basically did everything on this one so i felt really good about this whole week if y'all remember this one so i literally did dang near all of this posted all of that so yeah we can tear this off this is just such a good feeling being able to like <laughs> complete your to-do list so all right five 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 so this i like to write in pencil i am on my bed writing so sorry if this is a weird angle but this is going to be the week of 7 16. it's 6 11. i'm watching queen of clearance i have 72 percent loaded on there um i basically got my little to-do list it's a lot less than the previous week as you can see um because i had a lot to do this week so this week so tomorrow starting monday <clears throat> I plan to just do everything, clean and organize my guest room and then clean a little bit in my guest bathroom. I'm going to put timestamps on that video that I'm uploading now. I'll go to the Apple Store, post a hair review from Love Me that I've got to post and then answer emails for tomorrow. And then if it falls through, I'll answer emails on Tuesday also. Tuesday is going to be a brand day for my um, hair collection. So I'm going to post the pictures of like the lashes, edit TikToks, do some more TikToks, go to the gym, just the whole like brand day, like everything AJB Beauty Collection. Wednesday is when I get paid. So I'm going to go grocery shop a little bit and then meal prep and then go to the gym. Um, and that's really all that I have planned for right now. Head and start cleaning my bathroom i gotta go back downstairs and get my freaking tripod but i'm gonna start on my bathroom i'm gonna put these in the washer and then i'm actually about to finally clean my shower <laughs> with my new little gadgets TikTok should be out soon okay so now I gotta clean up my mess my shower looks really good it smells really nice I'm excited to shower tonight so that took a lot out of me especially recording took a lot longer so I'm about to mop my floor finish cleaning up in my bathroom and then finish my bedroom and then that's all for tonight I'm gonna eat and I'm gonna lay down and I'm gonna watch YouTube baby okay 
something to just kind of look put together these pants are from H&M I believe and then just a little regular black shirt um today was supposed to be my but look this is what I don't like because it's a band right here and then my stomach comes out right there so I'll be trying to put the band down a little bit I don't know I may switch out my pants but anyways I plan to have today be my brand day so that's me organizing and fixing that stuff over there doing more content for the hair but i think i'm actually going to have today as me running errands um i'm about to take prince outside and then i'm going to get him situated and i i like to go to the gym in the morning but i think i may have to go to the gym later today um so i do need to run to i need to drop off my macbook first i was supposed to do it yesterday so hopefully i can just that can be a fast process i need to drop off my macbook i want to go to office depot to um get those pins that i like the toll pins t-u-l and i need to eat also so i'll probably get either like slim chickens um probably some chicken since i'm gonna be on that side of town or whataburger maybe um it's clear y'all i really need to go to like marshall's five below or home goods because i would like to find prince a new um harness he needs another harness and he also need more puppy bags i only have one more row of puppy bags and i actually got these from dollar tree but it's it's not many in the row, honestly. So it say four rows and like 15 bags. So the ones I normally get be having like 50 bags. So I'll probably go shopping for my son. And I kind of want to record a TikTok today, like a um, spend the day with me or whatever. Those kind of do really good on Instagram and stuff like that. So I'm thinking that I want to just kind of just record and mini vlog my day. I just dropped off my MacBook at Apple she said it's five people in front of me so she said usually since it's five people it'll take give each person like a day so since it's five people it'll be like up to like five days but the guy told me if i would have took it yesterday i would have got it in about by this weekend so today is only monday so tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday and then i should have it back sunday i do have a video already ready to post for this thursday and then i do have another video to post but it's like a hair review so it's not like a video video so what i'm vlogging now that you're watching this is probably going to be up maybe like on a monday because i am off i work this thursday friday i'm off saturday sunday monday tuesday i think so i, I can just you know edit sunday or monday whenever i get it back but i'm starving i am about to get gas though because i'm a costco member and if y'all are local i'm at the promenade so costco is past the promenade so i'm gonna go to costco i really don't know what i want to eat right now um i kind of want i want something cheap like i don't want mcdonald's but it's like the cheapest thing that's like close to me just to have a quick bite to eat before i like go home and cook and get a few groceries and stuff so, so I went ahead and got McDonald's. So sick of McDonald's. It's all me and my mama ate in Branson. Like I'm so sick of it. Stop the 
I'm a pop star, not a dog though. I'm a pop star, not a dog, not a I'm a pop star, not a dog though. I'm a pop star, not a dog, dog, dog. Back from the store or stores. <laughs> and I had to wait. I've been back for about like probably about an hour now. Had to take some time to cool off because something just pissed me off completely, girl. I am so heated. I was like so heated a while ago. And it is so hot, girl. My Kristen. Woo! Anyways, I'm back from these stores that I went to. I went to the Apple store, Office Depot. I went to Home Goods. I went to Kroger's, Walmart. Yeah, so we're gonna talk about Walmart real quick. I went to Walmart to get like $25 worth of groceries or whatever. And why did my cart declined at Walmart? But Cash App still like on the Walmart screen it declined, but it still took my $25 for the little bit of groceries that I was like buying with my Cash App card. My mama had like Cash App me some money. So it took my money. Why is Cash App doing this? I saw on Cash App it was talking about I think Twitter, how they basically like overdraft people accounts or whatever. But this time it like, it went through on Cash App, but Walmart like it wouldn't print me out a receipt. And the lady like obviously wouldn't let me get the groceries because it wasn't a receipt, but I'm like Cash App already took up my money. So I didn't contact the Cash App support or whatever. And they said, we haven't received a refund from Walmart yet. Refunds can take up to 14 days to process from the update, from the date of the issue refund. For more info, reach out to reach out to the merchant directly. We appreciate the opportunity to serve you. Your satisfaction is our top priority. So please let me know if there's any other information you need or anything. See, that's why I am done with Cash App. I'm literally about to just use like Apple Pay or whatever. I know some of y'all are probably gonna talk about Zelle or whatever. I haven't used Zelle before. And the thing is, I usually only send and receive money mostly from like, my mom or you know like personal people it's been very few times where i get like payments from like you know other people so done with cash app um i don't care to use zelle but trying to teach something like that to my mom to someone who's not tech savvy you know like older like older people just just don't get it nine times out of ten those are there are some older people now i know i got a lot of you know um older viewers or whatever it's just my mom does not grasp the concept of anything and literally i just tell her about apple pay so she on the phone trying to find apple pay like as like an app or something i'm like it's not an app so anyways that's that from walmart the only thing that i got was oh girl was some macaroni oh my gosh i'm about to lose it right now I got macaroni and pork chops. That's that's what I got. I can't even take it out. And then I need to put this in the fridge. Bacon. I went and got this bacon probably like two hours ago. So hopefully this ain't dead. Let me put this in the fridge. Kroger's. I got literally water and bacon. I got a six pack of Fiji. And then I bought a gallon of the Kroger water. So someone had commented under my video I think my last video saying something about my water. Hold on, y'all. They called me. I was talking about my water. Somebody had commented. Um, <clears throat> I was saying that I don't use the water, but I use the ice in my fridge because I thought, well, I did see stuff like floating, I guess, or something. But I did just pour a whole thing of water in a clear glass cup, and I didn't see anything floating. So I'm thinking like, hmm, is it the ice then? Like... I don't know so i just put ice into the clear glass so i'm gonna wait till this melt and see and i i did the water last night so i'm gonna wait till this melts i don't know it kind of looks like i will see i want to say maybe like something yellow like really really little bitty yellow something i don't know so i'm waiting on this to do what it do but from office depot I got pens. Y'all know I've been talking about these pens. I absolutely love this brand. I did switch and get a fine liner. So this is a um, smaller, uh, what is it? Smaller pen, so it's 0.4. I usually like to use 0.8. 
but I was able to test these out in store and I think these will be fine because I do like the Sharpie pen and the Sharpie pen is like a finer line like this. So I think it'll be fine. And like everything for Prince, I needed to re-up on some of his stuff. So I do like to use the pet wipes for him. And then I needed some more bags. He has one more roll left and I got these for $5.99, the Arm & Hammer scent. Well, the Arm & Hammer brand in fresh scent. A new dog bow, this was $12.99, which is very surprising. These are usually really, really high. So I don't really like these bows. So I honestly may end up switching these out here soon, but I think I'm gonna keep them because obviously I have stainless steel and then I kind of got the matte black and stuff going on. So the metal and then what caught my eye was this piece is brown. So y'all know everything in my apartment is like brown. I got hardwood floor. So I thought this would be really, really cute. It's small enough for him, but it's still, it rises off the ground because the vet and I just saw like on TikTok and stuff, it's really better for a dog's digestive system for them to really just eat kind of more so on like an eye level rather than them bending down and like going like that. Cause I noticed with Prince, he will bend down and grab his food and then he will look back up and chew his food. So he doesn't like eat, you know, with his head down. So last thing I got is him a new harness. I got it in a size medium. This was like a random find. It was $8 on sale. Regular $9.99. <laughs> All right, we got you a new harness, Poops. Let's see if it fits. Yes, it's a new harness. It's not a toy. <laughs> it's going crazy. Okay, let me see. Come here. Let's see if it fits you. <laughs> it's too big for my Poops. Poopies is too big for you. It was on clearance, so I hope I can return clearance items. Um, Cause I mean, it doesn't fit. So I'll probably go return this. I don't feel like going back out today. I'll probably go return it tomorrow and then go to like Marshall's and see because Marshall's usually have a little bit more. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. I'm about to take a shower and lay down. <laughs> Walmart, then just that, just that whole thing just just pissed me off. Okay, um, I'm literally about to shower, like I said, and lay down. I don't even feel like answering emails today, so we'll probably do that tomorrow or maybe late night. I don't know. I'm just talking. He's just looking at me. <laughs> No. I decided to go ahead and cook me something to eat because girl I'm hungry and I'm about to watch me some YouTube I've caught up on Raven and all of destiny now I'm about to go to some other new people that I just either found or got put on to for myself and I got my handy dandy iPad should be charged okay yeah we're on 100%, so I'm about to make a thumbnail folder for thumbnails right here. And then these, I need to delete those because those are old. So for Branson, I don't really know what I'm gonna do yet. So like the vlog kind of consists of a lot of things. So I'm going to airdrop 
10 photos to my iPad. To elements, we're gonna go all the way down to grid. I like to use either four or five pictures. I don't know, either that, or I think I may replace this with, I can do a selfie of me. And then we got that. Bay voted this way. <laughs> so now we're gonna have to add text to this. This is okay. So my last one was like this. If you guys saw that, if not, go watch. Um, yeah. So I'm just gonna put weekly vlog across the top. I don't know if I want to do it with that text or if I want to do it with how I did this moving vlog. So the thing is with the thumbnails, get a thumbnail that pops out like, you know, this is the first thing somebody will see so you really want it to really just pop out at the um, viewer. So with that being said, this is liquor infused. So that's what I'm going to type. Good morning. Today is July 18th. It is 11.09 in the morning. I've been up really since like 8.30. I kind of had like a slightly bad dream or whatever. But um, I just got done replying to brand emails um, since I was already just laying in bed. Might as well make myself useful. So I'm going to tell y'all how many emails I just sent out. So I just sent out 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 emails. And then my last email that was sent was from Shein. They had emailed me on the 5th of this month. So I am a little late, but basically just for another collaboration, whatever. So with that being said, I just sent over the items that I would like to promote for them. And the other collaborations is like something about wigs uh like boob tape um i've got well i just sent out add one more email to whatever i just said so yeah it's just a variety of stuff like i see like eyeglasses some type of like shower mirror just just random stuff i just replied back to but i did want to show you guys in my notes i already have basically stuff already made so in notes you know you can make notes or whatever and then i have pinned notes so my pinned notes is my video prices i have like passwords pinned and then i have um youtube music pinned so my youtube music i pay for this music i get a lot of y'all that ask where i get music from and what is this what's that the music that i pay for is listed right here because i have to link it down in my description box to give the creative credit um i get music through thematic you can do like epidemic sound there's numerous other accounts that you can pay for to use music but i just use thematic or whatever so these are the songs that i use from them the other ones are from i just type in free non-copyrighted music on either youtube soundcloud whatever the case may be and that's how i find it i will either screen record or download the link and then copy the link add it into something into a up youtube mp3 converter or whatever but yeah so since i already have all my video prices already on here all i do is just copy and paste like my prompt i guess or whatever and just send that over so it makes sending emails easier i just keep it pretty basic so i can just send it out to everyone so mine says hello very nice of you very nice of you to reach out and consider me i'd be happy to help you out my collaboration rate is there are no discounted rates available at this time the video agreed upon will be done within two weeks of receiving the product that's just the base that i send out whatever the company sends back questions concerns or negotiating i would just email them to whatever their response was Since I'm going to 
the gym, I'm going to go ahead and put half of my hair up. So this first little set of curls, I'm going to raise this up. Today is going to be leg day because the last day I went to the gym, I did upper body. So I won't have to like, when I do upper body, I like do like sit ups and stuff. So I won't have to like lay down on my hair. So I'll be able to wear my hair like this in the gym. I'll probably have to redo the clip, but this is normally how I wear my hair to the gym. Sometimes I'll put it all the way up, but like I said, I'm doing legs, so it ain't gonna be too much movement like this. It's just lower body. Um, the set that I'm wearing is from Forever 21. Um, I like their athletic shorts. I forgot what these are called, but basically I got dang near every color. I had already had like five colors, but then I was really, really working out in like 2021. Really, I was working out up until I got to my goal weight. Once I got to my goal weight of 130, then I hit 140, then I hit 150. And it's like, I basically slacked off because I was, you know, at my goal and you're not supposed to do that. Like, baby, you doing this for a reason. Like you got to your goal for a reason. So my cousin actually bought me like seven to eight more colors in this uh brand or whatever forever 21 so the top is from there and the bottoms um i usually just mix and match so i have this color and i have a black color of this and then i also have a sports bra on kind of from uh pink victoria's secret so yeah usually i just switch out my colors and mix and match so this is a more affordable brand than like gym shark and stuff because you know i got some gym shark but if you are on the budget i think these shorts are only like at the time i think mine were like 12 13 dollars if that so yeah i like it super cute they always do the booty good they not see-through i think i only got one pair that may be a little see-through but yeah i don't know if i'm gonna wear my waist trainer or whatever today maybe not since i'm not doing any i don't know but I can't really eat too heavy before I go to the gym either. So that's why I'm thinking of just cooking like a few pieces of toast and then just drinking a lot of water because if I eat like bacon and eggs and all of that, it's going to be bad. And plus my stomach is already on, you know, 10. <laughs> so I may just cook me up some toast, drink a lot of water and just go to the gym because usually upper body takes a lot more out of me than lower body because i am more dominant in the lower body like that's all i've been training for years really so yeah but this is how you know when my hair is gym attire i'll probably take a few little boomerangs and picks um it is early so i'm about to go ahead and try to get this out the way i like to be in the gym for about an hour um since i'm doing lower body it may not take as long it'll probably be about like 45 minutes i like to stick with about four to five different exercises so when i go in i hit the stairmaster for five minutes five to ten minutes for a warm-up and then I will go, depending on if somebody's on my machine, like on the equipment or whatever, then I will go to the Smith machine. I would do squats or hip thrusts or um, like lunges. How you hold it and then you go back and lunge. I do a various different exercises on the Smith machine. Um, and then I would do like leg extension and j just, you know, all of that. So I will pick about four to five exercises and do those. So I feel like I've been talking for a while. I take prints out so I can already be on the I-10 by 10, okay? And yeah, I don't know if I don't, I'm probably not gonna take my camera to the gym because like I said, it's only gonna be like my fourth or fifth time at the gym. And I really don't want like a big camera out. I may record something on my phone, like little bitty clips or something, but I don't know. I ain't comfortable bringing a camera to the gym yet because you know, this ain't really just like my gym, my gym. You know, like I got a membership, but you know, you know, you know. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Take this little boy out because he's been staring at me for the longest. <laughs> and then I'll talk to y'all. So I'm back from the gym. I probably may put in some boomerangs, whatever, if I took some. But we're back. I weighed in at 143. I am trying to gain my 10 pounds back. I used to be 153. So I want to gain my 10 pounds back, but like in the right places and gain them back and be toned. So I would like to be looking like this and not like this. <laughs> but my workout was good. It kind of ended short because I didn't really eat this morning. Um, and I cannot, I'm not the type of person to eat when I first wake up anyway. It will make me sick. So that's why I never really used to eat. Anyways, I ended it kind of short. I was in there for maybe like 35 minutes, but I am probably gonna get Wendy's on my way to Bay House and just eat Wendy's in the car. 
Um, like I said, I am bringing prints, so I'm about to shower real quick and I'm about to pack a little spin on eye bag. Um, really, all I need is like clothes. I have every other thing there, like hygiene wise. Um, but since I did wear some of my clothes back with me and Nikki, and anyways. I wore some of my clothes back, so I got to bring some more stuff down there. So I'm probably about to bring like some t-shirts and just some lounge around stuff that I don't really like wear too much here. And I am about to keep a pair of blue jean pants down there just in case. Um, because literally, uh, after Nikki's birthday, the vlog previously, we went wine tasting. I didn't have any clothes really that matched <laughs> to like just wear anywhere out. So I'm about to pack my bag, but I'm also about to just get... A pair of jeans that like I don't really you know grab you know everybody got their favorite pair of jeans so I'm um, just want to take some jeans over there that obviously just isn't my favorite like that I don't wear every day but I will have some over there if need be so I think I'm gonna go ahead and take one of these one of these are from Timu and one of these are from Fashion Nova yes yeah, so these right here are these she in Okay, that's she in. One of these pairs of pants I got from Timu, I think. I'm going to go ahead and take these from she in, and I'm just going to leave these over there just so I can have a pair, a pair of just, you know, jeans. Hell, yeah, my camera may time out on me, but I am at the gas station. I'm at Costco. I just left Home Goods returning my, um, that harness for Prince. So I'm about to get gas real quick and I don't know which card I need to use, girl. And I also need to throw out a lot of junk because I've been eating my car. So I got Wendy's and McDonald's in here. So. So when it got me a wax today at the European Wax Center, my girl Star, if you're local, I go to her on McCain. She is literally the best waxer. Woo! The best waxer. That okay, this is why I got a car mount <laughs> to put y'all up. I already have the little scrub, but she um, told me to get, she says you need to be using like some lotion and stuff down there but obviously the ones that they sell but this is what i got the ingrown hair serum this is what they put on after they get done with your wax and i'm excited it's like 30 dollars. the lotion is a little bit cheaper but yeah the um scrub that i got literally lasts me about almost two months in my hair like what she waxed today wasn't even much and it's been a month in like four or five days and she was like yeah i'm gonna start seeing you every like six weeks and then maybe it'll be like eight weeks like this product i kid y'all not it works so amazing so yeah that's just that Oh, M G, y'all. I am so tired. 
My watch did. What time is it? It's 7:25, July 19th. Y'all, I don't know why I be doing that because it's not like y'all can see the time. And why do YouTubers do that? Why do we tell y'all? <laughs> why do we tell y'all the time and then show y'all? I'm gonna go in and talk about the food first and show y'all. Just got two lunchables for snacks. This is my favorite cheese. Two different variations of pizza. I'm actually about to cook this big pizza right now. I got my oven preheating. Needed some more noodles, um, bologna, just a little quick, you know, you know, back in the day. Don't don't allow like y'all to bougie for some bologna now. <laughs> and then I got this pack of chicken breast. This is all from Kroger's, by the way. 23 grams of protein. So yeah, we're gonna be eating good. Y'all know I really only like Velveeta mac and cheese. Like that's my go-to, baby. Like Velveeta, okay? Okay. But your girl is balling on a budget right now. So, you know, we just gotta make sacrifices. So they have four for five dollars. So I got four of those. Just I still eat ravioli as like a snack, if you will. So I did get that. I like the mini. And then y'all know I tried the Popsy drinks. I believe that's what they're called. A few of y'all was telling me to try Olipop and I wanted to try them anyway. So I also got the grape. I already tried grape in um what is it poppy popsy whatever and then i got the tropical punch the grape and the popsy disgusting the only good one was the strawberry limeade i think or cherry limeade so yeah i'm excited to try these um and then i got milk and i got cranberry juice cran apple in there excuse the way i look girl but from marshall's my total was a hundred dollars hmm anyways Starting off, I got, okay, I went to the European Wax Center. I think I already showed y'all this, so I'm excited to use this tonight. Um, and then from Marshalls, like I said, my total was $100. This is what I went into Marshalls for. Hopefully this fits. I had to get Prince another harness. It was $8.99. It's by RC Pets. It's in an extra small, so I'm gonna try this out. I did just take them out, so I'll probably just try it on and use it for tomorrow. But the other few things that I got <laughs> from Marshalls that I should have been getting was this um, drain wig. So basically, y'all know my shower is like that big walk-in shower, and I don't think I can like lift that little thingy up. Anyways, this is to like catch the hair. So this is basically what the job is going to be doing. This little flower for me. So got that two ninety nine. Then I needed some more socks. My mama is supposed to give me some socks. She's been, I've been forgetting to get those socks from her for months, and I definitely need some more socks, especially since I'm going to work tomorrow. I just. I got mixed match shot socks. I got socks I can't even find no more. So we're gonna do going into like hygiene and stuff now. So they had the honey. <laughs> Can I talk? They had the honey pot up in there. I know this was like a little uproar when I guess they like changed the ingredients or something like that. I don't know. I've never really been a honey pot fan to be quite honest. Um, I used to buy these and then the pump would like stop working for me. And then I switched to the honey pot. Like they had like a gel type of thing and I really really love that one though like that one did me right so I decided just to go ahead and get the sensitive try them out again because I know some people still really like them um so yeah I got that this was $6.99 so this is definitely cheaper than they sell it in stores for needed some more body wash I got the Nivea rose and almond milk I absolutely love Nivea lotion y'all know that's my favorite lotion so I got that this is $5.99 and then they also had the Ali little sleep melatonins. These were $7.99, so these are cheaper. Also check the expiration date, baby. It don't expire until December 2023. So that is a good steal. Like Marshalls, where they start getting all this stuff, girl? Super, super nice. Then the other two things that I got is this African black soap. Ironic that I just saw a TikTok of a lady showing how actual real African black soap is supposed to look in this dark, basically boo boo brown color. And I like looked them up and stuff like that, and it's actually like real. So I'm excited to finally get my hands on some real African black soap. Got that. Then I also needed some more moisturizer. Some of y'all asked me where did I get my vitamin C oil from that I was using. I get it from like TJ Maxx. Um, Marshalls, any place like that. Um, Nikki had actually gifted me that I think last year, or maybe yeah, for like Christmas. Anyways, these are the places I get it from. This is the one I got the vitamin C and collagen moisturizing day cream, and I like the vitamin C because you know it's brightening and stuff like that. So, super excited about that. 
Also from Marshalls, this is $6.99. I got the Sexy Soft Lip Scrub. This is in the peppermint scent, I guess. Um, it definitely smells good and it looks pretty good. So I'm excited to use this. I've been searching for a lip scrub for so long, girl. So this is the brand. This is what it looks like. If y'all want to check them out and get you some. Next thing I got is this wax stick. Needed another one. It was $4.99, not too bad. Um, this is usually the kind that I get, but I usually get the small tube, so got that. Next I got some pimple patches. It's the It's Fix brand. Um, never heard of them, but I got 72 patches for $3.99, so period. Um, yeah, excited. Definitely needed some more of those. And I think that's all from Marsh. Oh, besides these last three items, girl. <laughs> Why did I buy a steamer? Because I need one. Okay. Pure Steam, Pure Enrichment is the brand, five year warranty, whatever, whatever. I needed it because clothes, furniture, pillows, table lines or linens, clothes, furniture, pillows, silk, satin, and delicates. Baby, needed this. My curtains, my pillow, like, I needed this. And then I just bought those shirts in Branson. If y'all watched my last weekly vlog, that needed to be like steamed out. Yeah, this was a really good steal, I feel like. It was $14.99, so I think that's a good, I think that's a good price. What y'all think? Yeah, anyways. Then I also got these two. Before y'all say it, my loyal subscribers. Y'all know that I already have three of these, but they are glass. But I think I'm just gonna see if Bay want those because he be trying to be like me oh so bad. <laughs> but I'm, um, I got these because these are bigger. These are 56 ounces and they had them for $6.99. They did have three, but I went ahead and just bought two. I like them. They're plastic, first off. My other one's glass. These actually have the little proportion, like so you won't take off the whole top and like spill out. So I like these because, I mean, my other ones, they definitely worked for the time being, but I like these because it's like portion control. So I don't have to like spill all my drink out. So yeah, that's my little Marshall's haul. My last place that I went was Ulta. Um, I wanted to go to Ulta because I wanted that sunscreen. Your girl has been getting really, really, really dark, okay? My color always comes back in the summertime, I mean, in the wintertime, but whatever. Talk for eight minutes. I got the Black Girl Sunscreen. I've been hearing a lot of people rave about it. It looks really nice. I'm excited to put this on for tomorrow. Do I gotta go anywhere tomorrow? Besides work. Girl, I don't know, but I may use this tomorrow before I go take prints out and stuff like that. I got that from Ulta, and I also, I wasn't going in there for foundation, but I did run out of foundation. My favorite foundation for the summertime is MAC. My favorite for the wintertime is Fenty. MAC just does it for me. Like it's really, really full coverage. It like, if I'm sweating in this hot heat that we've been having, like it, it's perfect. But I did want to try a lower budget um, foundation. So this is just the Maybelline Fit Me Foundation. And y'all know this is like drugstore, so it was only $8.99. Um, my color in MAC is NC50. This one, she kind of helped me match up. Obviously you can't try these out because they're so cheap but she said if it doesn't work out, just take it back and get, I think, 356, so this is 355. So I just wanted a drugstore affordable one because I do like the powder foundation in this, so yeah. Got that, and basically y'all, that's all my little, that's everything that I bought today, my little shindigs that I. All right, we about to see if this work. I guess I did pick y'all back up after all. Whew. I feel like the head part, it's so tight, I don't know how to loosen it.